Greetings, my name is Daniel. This video tutorial will show you how to use Next Render add-on Layer Material Schemes. The first step is to go to nxtrender.com slash download, scroll down to the bottom of the page, and select Download next to Add-on for Next Renders. After the file saved, install it. The first step is to launch AutoCAD. After you do, type nxt underscore layer underscore materials. This will launch the application. If the application doesn't launch properly, visit nxtrender.com and look at the instructions for details on how to correct it. Now let's explore the interface a little bit. If you click on options, you'll see that this will let you change the path where the material schemes are saved. We'll use the default for now. You'll see there's three columns, Save Schemes, the Material Listing, and then Thumbnails of the Materials. The Save button actually saves your current material listings. We're going to go ahead and create one that's called White. Click the Save button and it'll add it to your Save Scheme list. The first step in creating different material schemes is to assign materials using the NXT interface. After you've finished assigning your materials, go ahead and relaunch the Next Layers Material Scheme interface. Now you can create your different schemes. I've created Light, Medium, and Dark. To change materials, select a Save Scheme, click on the Apply button, and then all your materials are updated in your view. Then from this point you can render each view based on your material schemes. This add-on simplifies changing materials on the fly. Once you complete your renderings, you can show your client the different schemes, and then if they want to explore another one even further, it's easy to go back to the scheme, make some edits, and then show them again. Thank you for watching the next render video add-on on layer material schemes. Happy rendering!